Hey everyone, what is up? Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be watching X-Men The First Class and I know, I know, I've been keeping this held up for way too long, therefore I'm going to keep this intro very short, but yes, I absolutely love the previous X-Men movie, which was focused on my baby, Wolverine. So I guess we're just going to get back into a wide range once again, and I cannot wait to watch this one because so far I am enjoying the X-Men journey. I haven't been delaying it because I haven't been enjoying it. I've just had a couple of things. I had my birthday on the 3rd of July. I've also went on holiday, as you guys will know. And I've also been through a very traumatic nose experience whereby I decided just to walk into a glass door thinking it's open when it quite clearly wasn't. So a lot of events have happened, but I'm back. I'm better than ever. I'm gonna be sipping on my squash today. Yes, yes, not quite water, but we're gonna be staying hydrated, baby. And yes, I'm super excited to get into this one. Therefore, let's just jump straight into watching the first class. Damn, this sounds very gloomy and disturbing. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Have I clicked on the wrong movie? I swear. <laughs> Man, this was so distressing to just watch. What is it with these dark places? We got a bat and a dark kind of place. This is not very inviting. <laughs> Once again. I didn't mean to scare you, darling. I was just getting a snack. Go back to bed. What's the matter? She looks guilty AF. And what have you done with my mother? My mother has never set foot in this kitchen in her life. Oh, is this like a throwback? Mystique. Oh, damn, this has got to be a throwback. They are young. You're not scared of me? I always believed I couldn't be the only one in the world. Mm. The only person who was... different. And here you are. Charles Xavier. What? Oh no! Is this one gonna make me emotional? I'm not ready. The key is the Schlüssel. To detour to an annoying sight of met Eric. I don't know you. So Oh, I don't know if I can take this seriously. Now I know what they're like grown. I'm like, hmm, I don't know if I can take this seriously right now. What? Wow, he is Oh, when we pull out this, uh-uh. She's Wow. How he's just gonna direct it like it's nothing. Oh my gosh, I can't watch this. Oh my god, just move the coin, oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, move, 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 move! Oh. Mother, why? That's one way to make Lila angry. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him! Don't, oh wow, don't be touching him like that. Mm -mm. Oi. Switzerland. That's about what, 18 years after? Would you date me? Of course I would. And a young man would be lucky to have you. You're stunning. Looking like this. I, you, what? I love how she's always had the flicky hair from such a young age. But I'm kind of liking this little time skip. Oh, going back in time. <laughs> I guess you could say more like. Drivus Schmidt. Klaus Schmidt. Klaus. Who is deal? Is that for a vengeance? Don't buy your address. No, so far. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, no, I can't see this. I can't, I can't see this. It's going to be gross. It's going to be gross. Oh, that's the noise! <gasps> okay, that was a lot less dramatic than I thought it was going to be. But that looks hella dramatic! Is that Colonel Hendry? The NATO guy? 
Yeah. So many violent faces in this. Damn. Hello, girls. Wow. Really be zooming in on that booties like that. Hello, beautiful. How are you? Hey, baby, um, you want to find a quiet place? I'm so sorry. I think I'll get Colonel Hendry. I don't think I'm going to like the way this ends. It's either going to be hella creepy or someone's going to get killed. Can't see it being pleasant either way. Oh! Damn, that was some smooth ass transition though. But just imagine, imagine having something like that. Where just with a flick of a little button, you can just get out of such an awkward conversation. Like imagine on a date, oh my god, imagine on a date. It was when you just press this button, you're like, see ya. And then won't feel awkward about it either. <laughs> Invention, I think so. I knew it was going to be creepy. Oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. What the hell did you put in my drink? Oh, just gonna wipe him out like that. Come lead. What the hell just happened? I agree with you, General. I've reconsidered my position and I now believe we should oh, put Jupiter gosh. missiles in Turkey. Colonel Hendry is here, so I'm- Oh, you're doing this again. <laughs> we find an expert on genetic mutation. I love that they just don't give up and they just keep going on like a bloody trooper. We love troopers. Argentina. When Schneider. There's gonna be a fight, it's gonna be a fight. Someone's gonna smash a glass. No, no. Blut und Erde. Ja, was würden Sie gerne zuerst verlieren? We have our That's our blood. I mean, I like the fact that the music is suspenseful, but it kind of gives it away sometimes. Let's just say I'm Frankenstein's monster. Oof. Oh, Frankenstein's monster. Mm -mm -mm. Gonna be giving this label. Yeah, after you, boo. I'm looking for my green. <laughs> Took us from single-celled organisms to the dominant form. You know of what? This routine may go over great with the coeds, but I I'm here on business. Just cut into the chase. No small talk over here. Professor, this is very important to me, and if I can help you, I will do my utmost. Oh, so many places! Let's wrap things up, shall we? Oh. 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 oh whoa. Mm -mm -mm. Fun stuff is what I can do with it once I've got mm -mm. it. Now he's gonna show you. Demolish. Finished. One of the many spectacular things my mutation allows me to do is that I can read your mind. Goddamn spy! You brought a goddamn spy into this facility. Not here. <laughs> Stunned. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. I've just frozen him for a moment because I'd like to talk to you. It's good, isn't it? I'm as interested in this Sebastian Shaw as you are, and if you still want my help, meet me on the third floor of the parking garage. Imagine just having that little voice in your head. What would you do? What would you genuinely do if someone just said the same to you? Would you go? Or would you bottle it like I would because I'd be shit scared? And yeah, think about it for the rest of my life. But I, I cannot take you anywhere else Without permission from upstairs. Would you like to see one more magic trick? Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> Good idea. He's easily sold. I like it. <laughs> Should I see a magic trick? Yeah, okay, get in there. <laughs> yeah, doctor. Mm, here we go. Back for revenge. <sighs> She's a tough cookie to have on side. Mm -mm. She good. Oh, wow. That idea kind of flopped. 
I have a telepath. I've lost sure. I've lost. I've lost sure that. Jesus. Oh. I can literally finish anyone off. Time to go. Oh, whoa. Well, I don't want to know how long that took to make, but uh, it's finished. This bit's kind of exciting. Oh! You can't. You'll drown. You have to let go. I know what this means to you, but you're going to die. Eric? You're not alive. Oh, man. It's crazy to see what they've actually gone through in the other movies and just to see how they actually come together in the first place. I kind of like this throwback. It's going to be very insightful. I can feel it. These are the special new recruits I was telling you about. This is Hank McCoy, one of Hank. our most talented young researchers. Hank! <laughs> ah! Stop. So your mutation is what? You're super smart? Oh, I love Hank. <laughs> I mean, that does look kind of creepy, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Do you remember that time when we introduced to Hank and he was literally just upside down? <laughs> so. What am I thinking? I don't know. Oh, look at him trying to flirt. Okay. I wish she could actually see what he was thinking. Imagine if he was lying. She's like, you snake. You snake. I know. I know what you've been thinking. Damn. What? They are hella in the middle of nowhere. I kind of like it. Imagine that for a getaway. Bloody hell, I don't know whether I'd be terrified or excited. Spontaneous, I guess, right? <laughs> Different. Sorry, did I hurt you? Oh, Kinky. really a romantic time to kiss when you spin job like that. What do you know about me? Everything. Then you'll know to stay out of my head. Old friend. <laughs> oh, I've missed hearing that. The electrodes connect Charles to the transmitter on the roof. When he picks up a <coughs> mutant, his brain sends a signal through a relay, and then the coordinates of their location are printed out here. Stay strong, stay strong. It's working. Wait, do we find out how he, how he turns out in a wheelchair? More tea, Vicar? And if I do, she's like, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, she's gonna be flapping up in here. How would you like a job where you get to keep your clothes on? <laughs> I love that. Take us all the way. That's a six hour drive. That will give us plenty of time to mm. talk. First guy I've ever met who actually prefers solitary confinement. You like fish, I like fish too. Maybe we should get a bite sometime and talk about it. I'd rather go out with the fish. <laughs> oh, that is a savage. Ah! Tell Xavier, go fuck yourself. Or was I expecting anything different? And this is why he's my favorite. He just doesn't give a shit and I bloody love that. Oh, who's gonna be getting that one fixed then, bro? Stage name is Angel. <whistles> kind of fits. You can fly? Uh-huh. And um... <laughs> oh! They're really gonna be wrecking the place by the end of this little party. Come on, Come on. Alex. 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 Gosh, we've got a whole little stage out here. <laughs> oh. Get back. <laughs> He's the type of person. He's like me. Like I know I can do this, but just don't watch me. <laughs> 
come on guys. How are we actually gonna get this whole situation rectified at the end? Is there someone that can either rewind time or just put things back together maybe? Thought about that? What the hell? <laughs> oh come on, don't be a party pooper. What are you doing? Oh come on, love. I'm having such a blast. You should be Professor X and you should be Magneto. Oh this is where they pull through with the names. I expect more from you. Well, I mean, they kind of stuck with it, so I guess it couldn't have been that bad, right? No matter what happens, act normally. I'll take care of this, all right? If someone told me to act normal, I would be the most no. abnormal I've ever been just because someone's told me to act normal. So you must be busy planning your next move. But with the Americans refusing to remove their missiles from Turkey. You know, I can't talk about those things, Miss Frost. Emma. And don't worry. Oh gosh. You don't have to say a word. Surely she's sensing something at this point. <laughs> Cutting it fine. Radiation gave birth to mutants. What will kill the humans will only make us stronger. Beautiful, isn't it? Oh no, the sun doesn't feel right. Yeah, you don't say. Oh. What is that? <gasps> oh, oh my gosh, she's finished. Uh. Oh, bloody hell, we've only just fixed that window. Stay here, my ass. Let's go. True. I mean,. I just don't think you're safe regardless, right? And I am not here to hurt you. Hey. Azazel. <laughs> <laughs> or you can join me and live like kings. Girl. Girl. She didn't even have to consider that. She literally just walked away. Like she'd been thinking about it the whole bloody time. Protecting your fellow mutants? It's a noble gesture. Adapt to this. Oh! Oh, oh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh no, it's just gonna deteriorate. If that ship crosses the line, they will have declared war against the United States. We will have no choice but to retaliate with a full nuclear response. Damn, a lot of them as well. This is gonna be crazy. Ooh. This is yours. No, it's ours. Oh no! Stop, because I actually got so emotional when Xavier got taken out by Jean and just seeing the score there passing everything on to Storm My stepfather took the possibility of nuclear war quite seriously this way See this is the type of music you know they're getting ready they're getting ready for the mission This is like a not even suspenseful it's like a we about to get things popping over here type music Maybe you're ready And pow 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 baby And don't forget to scream. I'll be like, ah. <laughs> 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 Imagine being like a neighbour, just on the other side of the road and just seeing that. They're like, what the bloody hell is he doing? If you're using half your concentration to look normal, then you're only half paying attention to whatever else you're doing. Just pointing out something that could save your life. Oh. Whoa. What? Oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay.
does that not remind anyone of Austin Powers <laughs> when she has like the shooters? <laughs> it just goes boop 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 boop. <laughs> Oh gosh, the things I remember in life are very concerning and disturbing, but I can't like it. Reservedly. I trust you. I'm touched. I don't trust him. Say nothing. <laughs> I want to die. Oh, all right, look, we're not going to make you do anything you don't feel comfortable with. Right? Oh! 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 Eric! oh my gosh. No, it's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. It's going to be fine. Hey! See, sometimes you just need that little push to be get over your fears like that. All right, Alex, I want you to hit the X and try not to hit me. That's a good chap. You're serious. I'm very serious. I love how they just run off anyway. <laughs> Turning it to face us. Come on. I got this. <sighs> I believe that true focus lies somewhere between rage and serenity. He's going to watch the mum scene again. So come on. Try again. Man, it just saddens me that they go against each other at one point. Hmm. This bit's kind of emotional. <laughs> oh, that bit got me teary, shit. But even if we save the world tomorrow, and mutants are accepted into society. My feet in your natural blue form will never be deemed beautiful. She's beautiful blue as well. Listen to me very carefully, my friend. Killing Shaw will not bring you peace. Mm -hmm. Peace was never an option. It's these little catchy little phrases in this one. Oof. No. Mm -mm. I was going to say that's way too good to be true. This many turns into the hang, we know. Rawr. Wow. Yeah. I was going to say, like literally, where was we going to see the hang? We know, baby. I prefer the real raven. I said the real raven. Perfection. See, Hank wanted her to switch. It's time for you to be free. Oh, so this is where they get their attachment together. But no matter how bad the world gets, you don't want to be against it, do you? You want to be a part of it. I can kind of see where it all kind of just spins off in its own little different areas. You can see where the attachments are coming in, where the divisions are also placing. All suited and booted and ready to go. I'm here. Oh, this is the Hank we know. It didn't attack the cells. It enhanced them. Never look better, man. Hank? Oh! Even I gotta admit you look pretty badass. I think I got a new name for you. Beast. Target ready to be fired upon, sir. <sighs> stand by to fire. Oh, stand by to fire. This is the bit where it starts getting stressful. This is the music. We start him, baby. Do not fire. Repeat. Do not fire. They signaled the cargo huh. ship to turn around, sir. Uh-oh. Here he goes. Here he goes. Oh. Oh. Ugh. It's when they get sidetracked. It's that little thing in their head. That? The Russians. They have fired on their own ship. A little warning next time, Professor. Sorry about that. <laughs> you right? <laughs> I mean, like, I, I think I'm okay, but maybe let's just plan the next one. <laughs> We're moving to a backup plan. 
Back at plan B. Well, then he must be underwater. I love how far he's come. How he just dropped out of that window and then he's just been flying ever since, baby. You ready for this? Let's find out. Oof, the absolute showdown. Oof. Remember the point between rage and yes. serenity. No, oh, I did it. Man, look how strong these two were, just together. Yeah, stunning everyone over here. Oh gosh, oh gosh, it's gonna wipe him out, it's gonna wipe him out. Talk about slow-mo over here. Ooh. Yes. Oh. oh, it's gonna be the head dead showdown. I'm not ready, but I can't wait. Ready? I can't wait. Here he comes, little butterfly wings. Oh. He's like, see ya. Oh, maybe not. Oh no. I'm telling you, he's not. There's no one here. God damn it. Uh oh. Uh-oh! Behind you! Behind you! Oh, hello! Let's go! From that little party, and they know when to shut the ears. Ooh! That little thing can do a lot of things. To unlock your power. To make you embrace it. Ooh, trap him in, trap him in. Stop. Azazel. Ooh. Oh. Hi. Oh, baby. Oh. You are my creator. No, Charles. Ah. Ooh. Sorry, Charles. Eric, please be the better man. And I don't trust you. What? I'm going to count to three. And I'm going to move the coin. One. Lead Eric. This is where it actually begins. Three. Uh, uh. I feel their guns moving in the water. Their metal targeting us. Here come the fires. Shots. Fire! Oh. 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 oh yeah, I forgot he could do that. Do you remember he did that with the guns? And then you just turn them around, and whoosh. Mad power that man holds. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Someone stop him! Someone stop him! Oh my hell! No! Ah! Yeah, we'd definitely be seeing a different side of him in this one. Oh! Ah! 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 Bloody did this. She didn't do this, Eric. You did. Yes. I want you by my side. We're brothers, you and I. All of us together, protecting each other. We want the same thing. I'm sorry. 
but we do not. Mm. This is where they split paths now. Who's with me? Ugh. One more hiding. Oh shit, see this is where it happens. You should go with him. It's what you want. You promised me you would never read my mind. I know. I promised you a great many things, I'm afraid. Oh. I'm sorry. But just how he betrays her. It's actually annoying knowing what's about to happen. Because I know Eric betrays her at one point. Mutant and proud. I can't feel my legs. Oh. Oof. Oh my gosh, this gives me goosebumps. So how many students do you think you'll have here once you get the academy up and running? Oh, am I finding this emotional? You're your own team now. It's better. You're X-Men. <laughs> Oh. I forgot about her for a second. I'm not gonna lie. Eric, I believe. Magneto. Magneto. Oof. Ooh, ooh, ooh. You really get the backstory in that movie because we've only ever seen them when they're grown. We only ever saw Xavier in a wheelchair. How did he get there? I never knew. I don't know. Did they mention it before? If so, I've completely bloody forgot because now I bloody know. <laughs> Why do I keep saying bloody? Wow. But I love how we finally have had the backstory of everything. We've seen where they come together and how strong they made each other. I think that's why the moment between Charles and Eric, when he was teaching him to somewhat train his mind and just think, and the way he just managed to rotate that thing, I'm just going to call it that thing, to face him just shows how much of a contribution uh, Charles actually had on Eric. And to watch them both divide and knowing where their paths actually lead in the other movies was somewhat heartbreaking, I'm not gonna lie. That one did get me a bit teary. Not full-blown, but definitely teary, only because I know like what happens. Like, for example, the Mystique and Magneto situation Magneto? The Mystique Magneto situation. In that one scene when she tries to do everything to protect Magneto and he just watches her there after converting back and he just leaves her there. He betrays her. And what does she do? She bites straight back on his ass. So I feel like because I kind of know this kind of outlook on things, it does make it a little bit more emotional. Like, I feel like if I had watched this movie, prior to watching any of the others, I probably wouldn't have had the same effect, but this one definitely got me triggered. And honestly, just watching them from young and how they have grown and what they essentially become is a bloody crazy story. And I'm glad we've kind of got this movie and I'm glad this movie even exists just because of that. But thank you guys so much for watching. I did thoroughly enjoy that movie. Again, mainly because of the backstory. I feel like that's what we finally needed in this journey. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye! <laughs>